from Indy's streaming news leader. This is a WRTV update. Good afternoon, I'm Megan Shen, and here's a look at your top stories. Metro Police need your help with finding a toddler and his mother, two-year-old Nair Vance, was last seen around 9 o'clock last night. He was with 22-year-old Najee Jackson. Nair is only 2 feet 6 inches tall. He was last seen wearing a red basketball shirt, black sweats, and black and white shoes. The woman is the toddler's non-custodial mother, and they may be in a blue Chrysler 200. If you see them, call 911. This week, Mayor Joe Hogsett's plan to reduce gun-related crime will go before the city's Public Safety and Criminal Justice Committee. The plan for banning military-style weapons, raising the minimum age to buy a gun from 18 to 21 years old, and ending permitless carry in Marion County. The committee for the City County Council will review the plan on Wednesday at 530. Even if the city lawmakers make any changes, the changes would have to be to no effect until state law is changed. A new Palestine man faces charges today for his alleged role in a road rage shooting on I-465. State troopers say the 52-year-old man turned himself in on Saturday. The road rage shooting happened back on May 21st near I-465 and Brookville Road. A 19-year-old man was injured by the gunfire. Now the man who turned himself in faces attempted murder, criminal recklessness and battery charges. As of late May, state police have investigated two, close to two dozen interstate shootings at the Indianapolis district. Todd, it is a little bit cooler this morning. Yeah, you know, temperatures are going to be on the cool side here throughout the day today and even into tomorrow before we really start to warm it up. But the good news is after starting the morning off with lots of cloud cover, we'll see more and more in the way of sunshine the further we get throughout the afternoon and into the evening hours. But your temperature is likely going to stay only in the upper 60s here uh, for the middle of June, and those are about 10 to 12 degrees below normal. Now tomorrow, more rain showers enter the forecast. It's another cooler day with a high temperature right around 70 degrees. Could be some spotty showers to the north tomorrow morning. The better rain chances will be as we work our way throughout Tuesday afternoon and into early Wednesday morning.